Okay, so the trick to simultaneous equations is to work downwards. So we're going to be working downwards here. So we're going to be looking at the 6x and the 4x, the 6y and the 6y and the 42 and the 32. Now, we've got to make sure one of the coefficients, the numbers before the letters, one of them's the same. And if you look, the y's here are the same. Now, when they are the same, the numbers, and we ignore the signs, but they are both positive as well, we think, right, if they're the same signs, we subtract. But if they're different signs, we add. Because they're the same signs, we're going to subtract as we go along, and we're going to subtract downwards. So 6x take away 4x is 2x. 6y take away 6y, well that's 0, and the whole point of this is to get rid of one of the letters. And 42 take away 32 is 10. Let me draw our lines going down. And we need to find out what x is, so we divide both sides by 2. And x is 5. Now that is only half of the question done, because we need to find out what y is. So I'm going to pick one of the equations, I'm going to pick the one at the top, and I'm going to substitute uh, x in. So I'm going to do 6 times 5 plus 6y equals 42. And you could have taken, you could have used the second equation as well. Okay, so that's going to be 30 plus 6y equals 42. I'm going to take away the 30 from both sides. So 6y equals 12. Divide both sides by 6, extend my lines a little bit, so y equals 2. So my answers are x equals 5, y equals 2. Now if you've got some time, you can actually put those into the second equation just to check. So 4 times 5 is 20, 6 times 2 is 12, 20 plus 12 is 32. So we know it's the correct answer.